Oh, hey there, I'm just scavenging this building at the moment, but in this video I got you guys something that hopefully you haven't stumbled upon in Fallout 4. So, hopefully you find something new in this video, and you find some good loot to scavenge. What's up everybody, I'm back here in Fallout 4 showing you an unmarked location around the wasteland. And this one I have for you is the repainted long forgotten statue. And it's located right around here on the map. Well, as you can see they didn't exactly finish their job on repainting it, but it looks like they got started and got all the requirements ready. When you first approach this sexy deformed looking statue, you will encounter a decently tough raider. So, be wary of that. But once the raider is gone, there should be no worries whatsoever here. You can then start scavenging around. There is a Bob Rogue's best moonshine on the platform of this statue, with some paint buckets that they were going to be using for some color. Yellow paint, blue paint, and an empty paint bucket. Whatever color that might have been, could have been what is already on the statue. Although, that kind of looks like the weird looking paste that they were adding to create food. There's a backstory of that paste at Suffolk Charter School, and let's just say it's pretty creepy. The government is behind it. Anywho, enough about that. I believe that the statue's arm is his head, and the head is part of his arm. What a masterpiece. Oh, and there is some more loot to scavenge around, of course. Maybe not the best loot, though. The best part about this place is, of course, the masterpiece of a statue. But if you look in his hand, you can find a box with Jet and Psycho in it. Nice placement for a box. There is also a cooking station right by the masterpiece, and also a tent with a sleeping bag in it, with some armor inside the briefcase. This would actually be a pretty nice spot to set up in survival. Anyways, that's about it for the loot here, but if you go down the road nearby, there is a restroom place with trash, a cigarette machine, and a Nuka-Cola machine outside with a Nuka-Cola in it. So be sure to look inside that Nuka-Cola machine. And inside the restroom itself, however, is just a special surprise of a bug attack. So be sure to watch out for that when looking in there. Anywho, from the restroom, you can head up the hill and enter the house that overlooks the statue. And there will be another random bug attack in here. Also, it looks as if a guy got woken up by a sudden bookshelf falling over on him. Hopefully he had died quick and not slowly, but... Sadly, I have a feeling it was slowly just because I seen a wheelchair in here too next to the desk. So he might have been paraplegic and the bookshelf fell over on him where he couldn't move no longer and he just starved to death underneath the bookshelf. Unless this was a setup to stage a murder and the murderer is out there masturbating in the wasteland somewhere. If so, hopefully that murderer dies a horrible painful death of some behemoths penetrating his or her asshole. Anywho, getting a little off topic here, there's also a trunk in this house with a bunch of loot to get from it. So be sure to get the loot out of the trunk but yeah there you guys have it the forgotten statue unmarked location i have to say i love how odd looking this statue looks and i had to share this area with you all hopefully you found it enjoyable and it was something new to you in fallout 4 i mean that is my goal out of making these videos to allow you to see something new in fallout 4 but as always at the end of my videos i like to be a like whore and remind you guys to leave a like or hey maybe even share this video to people that'd be much appreciated don't worry i understand if instead you call me a dirty little slut and i need to shut my whore mouth up and stop being a like whore at the end of my videos don't worry no hard feelings if you tell me that instead i'll understand but this has been a video by your rifle and remember to stay safe out there everybody from rapists the world seems to be filled with those things for some odd reason and also another little life advice tip before i go try not to sleep and poop thanks for watching peace